Hey everybody, my name is Nolan and welcome back. It's another episode inside of my Minecraft survival world. And not gonna lie guys, I'm a bit disappointed because I had planned a time lapse for this video and unfortunately I can't get that to work for my creeper farm because it's just not working. Um, but hopefully maybe I can find something else to do a time lapse of because um, I really want to do one of those. But yeah, for this episode, I'm gonna keep the intro nice and short. Basically, um, all I want to do is build the creeper farm and finish the dog hanger. I should be able to do this all pretty easily. Um, I did a lot of resource gathering um, and a lot of sorting. And I also got some jungle saplings for a, from a wandering trader, so I now have jungle wood. And yes, I know, my shaders are off. I don't know why. Um, they somehow automatically turned off, so I'll have to take care of that eventually. Um, but yeah, I have all the materials um, over by the location on where I'm going to build the farm. Um, it's up at the top right of the map in that ocean biome. But yeah, basically all I'm going to do is just jump right into it. By the way guys, this farm is made by JC Plays. So if you want a complete tutorial uh, so you can build this in your own world, you can go check out the video there. I'm just going to be doing some like jump cuts and stuff like that to build this, so I'm not going to give a full tutorial. Um, but yeah, it's his farm, so go check that out. So guys, this is the area that I'm going to be building in. Yeah, that's where I was going to do the time-lapse thing. And, yep, I can't do that anymore. But, what is going on here? Um, actually, I could use ink sacks, so I'm going to kill all these guys. Um, but yeah, basically, uh, this is the area I'm going to do. As you can see, up there is where I'm going to start building the creeper farm. And, I swear that I got a trident here. Maybe I didn't. I don't know. Guess not. Um, doesn't matter though, I'm just gonna launch up there and I'll get started on this building. Oh, but before I do, um, check this out. Where is it? Um, here. <laughs> Look at how many freaking trap doors I got. Uh, that took all the iron in the world except for what I have here and then in my inventory. Uh, to make that trap- make that amount of trap doors. Um, yes, I need them for the farm. <laughs> but yeah, I think I have all the resources, so I'm gonna get started building. Okay guys, so I actually raised this up, like, a lot. <laughs> I raised it up, like, to Y level 196. Um, should be enough space still to build it up. Um, it's gonna look weird. I don't really know how I'm gonna make it look good over here, but I don't think I'm gonna be over here much anyway, so that's okay. Um, this is just to prevent mobs from spawning around me. And now I'm just gonna build my little area up here where I'll have all my collection going on. Alright, so here's my collection system. I haven't built the little trident killer thingy, but I think I'm gonna do that. Actually, no, I'll do that really quick. Um, but after that, I'm just gonna build a funnel that will go up. I'm gonna do that all in one step, um, just because I don't want this to get too dragged out. Um, so yeah, I'll just cut back when all that is done. Alright guys, so my next step is to build a giant platform all the way around here. Not really too sure how long this is going to take, but I know it's going to take a lot of resources, so I'm just going to crank this out really quick. Okay guys, I messed up bad. I messed up really bad. So you guys know those uh, trapdoors that I made? Yeah, yeah, well it turns out those were like for... You, basically what you do is you build like grids like this. They were supposed to go like in between and on the sides. That... Ugh. That's a problem. See, mine are iron trapdoors. Meaning that I'm gonna have to power every single trapdoor. Or instead just use buttons, which is what I'm going to do. But I made probably two times as many trapdoors. So now I'm just gonna have like so many extra trapdoors and I don't know what to do. Except now I, I do know where to go from here. So I'm gonna build one layer of this and then I'll show you guys what that looks like and I'll just cut back when that's done. Alright guys, so this is what a layer looks like. The creepers will just think that this is like a solid block, and then they'll walk off into the water. Um, I don't know how many of these I'm actually going to build. I'm going to build quite a few, <laughs> maybe like five. Um, so I don't really think you guys are going to want to see all that. It's just boring, so I'll just cut back when I'm done. Alright, so I have all this done, and I was actually able to crank all this out really quick because Hudson came online and he helped me, so big thanks to him for doing that. Um, now all I have to do is just put the roof on, you know, that giant big square that makes it all dark, and then this farm's done, so actually I'll be able to finish this all in one night, so that's pretty cool. Creeper farm is finished! It's magnificent, and is it working? Oh, it's, it's spawning drowned! Oh, can I get a trident right here? That'd be cool. I can't see. Oh, there's a creeper! Oh, there's actually a creeper! I couldn't see it! It's a creeper far, dude. Yeah, I, got, I, I couldn't see the creeper. And I didn't get the stupid trident either, okay. Um, I'm gonna check the chest, Sammy. 
Oh, I forgot the stupid trident inside. All right, that's the last thing I need, and then this farm is completely and utterly done. You worthless pieces of trash, sheep. Oh, there's a creeper protecting them. They have sided with the enemy. They're traitors. These sheep uh, no, are we disgusting. We don't, we don't kill them. We don't kill them. We should. We should record this though. I am. <laughs> okay. Don't. Don't. I'm not. I'm just gonna hit him with channeling so he becomes a charge creeper. That's not a bad idea, but also a really bad idea. It. Oh. Oh. Okay. Wait. Also, is my drown friend over here still? Hello. Oh, he is. Hello. He's still over here. Why? Why oh, he's, is that so much better? Bro? He's angry now. Here we have my <clears throat> nether hub. It says Hudson's house. Because that's my name. Hudson. Nice to meet y'all. Got some glowstone, a little bit of basalt, basalt. You got a nice uh, coloration here with the shading. Yeah, that's, that's pretty nice. Now, if you uh, enter through the gateway to hell. Technically, we're in hell. I have my house. So it's pretty much on stilts. I have glowstone buoys kind of supporting it around here. Walk up the staircase. Oh, and I terraformed all this down here in order to build it. That's why it's like a, there's like a bat cave down here. And then you have a nice little staircase coming up as well. Very regal. I went for a kind of like a modern Roman chic. I learned that from uh, Fixer Upper. Thank you, Chip and Joanna Gaines. Um, and then you come up here onto my 4,000 square foot patio. Raised at 1.1 million dollars by no one. Uh, to see a nice stone brick roof. I'm pretty sure the masons who created this roof were actually um, what alive the during what the fuck is this? periods where there was food. That is not funny! What? <laughs> and then this is my bedroom. This is where I like to, you know, bring all of the goats and cows and sheep that I collect on a daily basis. Uh, I'll just hide them in my room. This is kind of my everyday area. There's a tire on my wall. I haven't finished organizing my stuff. This, this is nice. You just sit on, yeah, like that. And then down here, this is cool. If you just need to leave the house real quick. I failed. You're in the water. How'd you fail? I and didn't land in the water. Here, tide, I just kind of swim under my face. And shoot my way back up here, like so. Okay, I'm ending cinematic mode. It's too it's too inconvenient. This is my bottom little area. I don't want to put down here. I have a mine also over here. Oh, creep. Oh, my. Why is this? Oh, Aiden. Yeah, this is probably where Aiden built up. Okay, one sec. Don't, don't jump down. Let me, let me clear this and then you can pop back down. Hello. So this is kind of where I'm going to start doing my mining. Down here, through the cobblestone, there's a bit of a tunnel that leads down to Y12. I haven't finished putting in the bubble elevator over there yet. And then up here, up here is the fun stuff. It's a little riptide course that you have to do to get out. Never mind, you locked this up too. Is there water? There was. Now oh, there is. Nice. Alright, watch out for me. I don't want to hit you. And then you kind of have to uh, move to the side. And then on this side, there's just a little pool of water. That you snap out of. Or it's like, I have to have to. I miss. There you go. <laughs> nice. And then this is my uh, stable for my horse. Horse collection. Uh, this is Donkey. Donkey. Yeah. That was such a here. bad Shrek impression. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it was pretty terrible. And yeah, this is where I uh, breed my horses. Oh, I fell. Thank you for uh, coming to Hudson's house tours. Uh, if you are interested in this property, please contact no one because it's not for sale. Oh. Okay, guys. So I know it's a bit loud. But, um, I have been AFK for about 16 hours now, and look at this. Is that like half a double chest of gunpowder? Over half a chest of gunpowder from this creeper farm. That is insane. 
I didn't even have to do anything, and I now have gunpowder to last me forever. So that means in the next episode, I will be able to make a sugarcane farm so I can make rockets to fly literally everywhere. But for now, I would like to finish my dog farm, so let's go get into that. Okay guys, so what I'm doing right now is I'm just finishing up the walls and stuff down here in the dog hangar, and also, I haven't finished the roof yet up top. I'm going to do that all afterwards. But um, I'd like to get the walls done, I'd like to get the roof done, I still need two more stone slabs. Let me just make that real quick. Boom. Perfect. Alright, so now this is all completely done. The wall is filled in almost. Okay, I have to put an iron door in there for my mine. And then also this is going to be like a connection to my house. This I have to do. Um, this will not take that long at all. But now all I have to do is the roof. And I was waiting to do this because I don't really exactly know what I'm going to do here. I'll figure it out though. But yeah, so all I have to do now is the roof. So I'm going to just copy the pattern that's on the floor here and build it up here. It's just repetitive, so I'll skip to when it's all done. Alright guys, so I made a couple changes. So, um, as you guys can see here, I removed the windows here, and I've made this ground more flush with everything around it. Um, it kind of looks weird from the outside, but it also doesn't at the same time. I don't really know. I think it looks fine. Um, and that's just because you'll see in a minute. You'll see what I did. But yeah, all this is now just one flat area. It doesn't, like, look weird or anything like that. But I've completely finished, almost completely finished the inside. So you just walk down here, down these steps, and as you can see, this place looks insane. I used a lot of iron bars, and I hope you guys can kind of start seeing now why I'm waiting to do all the building, and I'm building all my farms first. I've pretty much only built farms, as you guys know. Like, I mean, if you look at all my videos, I've pretty much only built, like, farms and, like, game progressy style thingies. The reason for that is because my builds are going to be super ambitious like this. I mean, this is a lot of iron that I just spent here on these iron bars. And, I mean, I don't want to have to go gathering those resources, so if I just have all the farms automatically gathering materials, then I'll just be able to go and build every episode. So that's basically what I'm doing right now, is like I'm building all the farms so I can build cool builds like this. Sea lanterns, iron bars. So all I have to do now is link this part up to my house, which is that staircase right there. Yeah, and then I can come down here whenever I want, directly from my house, and then I just have to put an iron door here, that'll take like two seconds. Um, but then yeah, this is pretty much done, so I'm just gonna link that up, and then I'll probably end the video. Okay guys, so I think I have finished down here, except, except for this part, don't worry, I'll take care of that. But yeah, I just built this like stairway, oh, I, I see something, I see something I missed. I'm just gonna fill that with this. Boom. <laughs> but yeah, uh, all you do is walk up here, and then you just follow this staircase, which is um, completely like blended with my house, and you can go right up to my house. So it's really convenient if I need to get down to my hangar, I can go down here and have all this space. Um, this is cool because I can use these like little cells and make them into hallways that go to different rooms, which is pretty cool. Um, so now all that I have to do is fill in that hole and build the roof. But by the way, guys. I'm going to skip the door because I want to build something cool here, but I don't know what it's going to be yet. So um, all I got to do now is the roof. Alrighty, guys, so I have completely finished the roof. And I don't know about you guys, but I think that this roof is actually pretty darn cool. Um, it's very similar to the one I made on my house, but just a bit different. It has a bit more layers and stuff like that. And yeah, I accidentally activated all my dogs um, because I used water to get up and down and it trailed all the way down. Um, but I think this looks pretty darn cool. So, uh, yeah, unfortunately I'm completely out of time right now, so I'm gonna have to end the video here. Um, if you guys enjoyed, be sure to like and subscribe for more Minecraft content. Um, I don't really up the upload these videos as regularly, but I still try and do it as much as possible. Um, so thank you guys for watching, and I hope to see you guys all in the next video. Peace.